It's about down to tune this. This is how I prepare. You have your knot here in the middle, you pass the leftover of the rope between the two verticals, and you get it like this. You pass it under the four ropes. Like this. Now, if you don't have a clamp lid, you can simply use a stick. We have this kind of knot. You do a loop like this. Up. How does it do? Ah. Up. Tack. And you take it as low as possible. Basically, you pass under two ropes and you come back between the two ropes under the previous rope. Like this. There is another up loop I do like this. And you can just up. Just do it. Don't over pull. If you over pull it, you will take it aside. It's important that it stay in the middle. So you pull both verticals equally. Then you can pass under two ropes and bring it as low as possible. This is when you flatten the previous knot. Back. Go up la. like this. This one is locked. From now on, I'm going to use this, which is much more convenient. To pass the rope under, you can fold the rope in two, you will have less rope to pass. Tack. You just grab it like this and you go as low as possible. Tack. And that's it. Okay, you pass under two ropes. Tighten it and then pass back between the two ropes. Top. And then, up, just pull it. By doing this knot, you actually flatten and place this nice. Do it always as low as possible. If you do it too high, it will not tune nothing. And anyway, the first tour of, of knots is not that strong. So don't be afraid. Top. Now, we are getting close to the end, and how to finish the tour nicely and clean. So it will be prepared for the second tour. Now we got the last X, the last one. Here I have one rope, here I have two. 
doesn't matter. Pass under everything. Up and And you watch only those two. And you do the same. Hop. Okay, now I'm done. Before I go to the second tour, I will lock the first one. So, how to lock this? I pass under this, the next to one, and then I will lock it down. Okay, I pass under everything. This is the moment you will need greater power. Tack. And that's it. Now you got it locked. Now I like for finish to just pass the rope around the drum quite tight so it won't fall. And mm, to finish this, again, same trick. That's it. You've got your first tour, nice. And the drums sound good.